Hey guys, in this video, I will be showing you how to use Signal without a phone number. The Signal app has been quickly gaining popularity for its increased privacy and consumer-friendly data usage policies compared to WhatsApp. However, to have the utmost privacy, you can use Signal without providing your own phone number. Making use of an app called TextNow, you can get a free phone number that you can then enter into Signal. I will be showing you exactly how on my iPhone. The steps will be the same on an Android phone as well, so you can follow along no matter what device you're using. The first step is to open the Google Play Store or the App Store on your phone and download the TextNow app. I have provided a link to the app in the description below. Once the app has been downloaded, open the app. Now tap on Sign Up. You will be given four different options to sign up for a TextNow account. Choose an option that best suits you. I will be going with the traditional email option. Enter in an email address and a password for your new TextNow account, and then tap on Sign Up. Now TextNow will ask you to enter in any Canadian or US-based area code. If you do not know what area code to enter, simply search for a US city's area code on Google and enter that into TextNow. Once you have entered in an area code, TextNow will show you a list of numbers from the area code you just entered. Choose a number you like, note it down somewhere, and then tap on Continue. Now you will need to give TextNow permission to send notifications and permission to access your microphone for phone calls. Both these permissions are required, as Signal will call you to send your verification code. Once you give the permissions, you will be taken to the home page of the TextNow app. If you forgot to note down your number, simply tap on the three-line icon from the top left corner of your screen, and your TextNow number will be visible there. So the next step is to open the Signal app, and then choose the same country as the TextNow phone number. For example, if you entered in a US area code, choose the United States as the country. Now enter in the TextNow phone number into the Signal app. Once you enter in the number, tap on Next. Now you will need to wait 60 seconds for verification by text to fail. After 60 seconds, tap on the I didn't get a code option, and from the pop-up menu, tap on Call Me instead. You will now be receiving a call in the TextNow app from Signal. If you do not see a call appearing, open the TextNow app, and the call should be visible over here. Answer the call and you will hear an automated message that will be saying your verification code. So I just received a call from Signal with my verification code. I will be entering this verification code into Signal. After you enter in the verification code, enter in your name and tap on Save. The Signal app will next ask you to enter in a PIN that will be associated with your account. Enter a four-digit PIN, or if you want to enter an alphanumeric PIN, tap on the Create Alphanumeric PIN option. Next, enter in the PIN once again to confirm and tap on Next. And as you can see, I have successfully set up the Signal app without a phone number. In case this method does not work for you, another way to use the Signal app without a phone number is by entering in your landline number. Yes, it is possible to use a landline number with Signal. All you have to do is wait for 60 seconds for verification by text to fail, and then choose the Call Me option, and you will receive a call on your landline with the verification code. This video took a lot of effort and troubleshooting to create. If this video helped you out, please hit the subscribe button to stay tuned for more videos like this. Also like and share this video.